Hello my YouTube friends, it's me, your old buddy Magnum over here at Magnum Videos. As you can see, we are no longer on the island. We are back in the Magnum Videos production studios. No more palm trees swaying in the tropical breeze, no more uh, bright sun, no more gentle waves coming into the sandy shore, uh, and no more beach balls. Everyone knows a beach ball can sometimes be a big pain in the ass, especially if it's spinning. If you have an issue with a beach ball, this is the video you've been waiting for because we're going to show you how to get rid of it today. And just like all of our other videos, this one was created just for you. Alrighty, if you have a Mac, chances are that you have at some time seen that spinning beach ball of death or the BBOD as it's called. There are a lot of reasons that that can happen. One of the reasons is that you've got too many uh, applications opened at one time. So in order to, uh, this is a two-step process, I'm going to show you uh, two ways or two things that you can do to help eliminate that spinning beach ball. The first one is to check and see what tabs you have open. In order to do this, you hit the command key and hold it down and then hit the tab. And as you can see, at this point I have QuickTime Player open and the Finder. If you've got a bunch more showing up in there, you can just put your cursor over them and hit, uh, hold down the command and hit the letter Q on your keyboard. So that is a pretty simple and pretty quick uh, fix that will help and if that doesn't do it, then we need to go look at your permissions. So you go into your applications. I'm, I'm down here at the bottom. Applications folder and go to your utilities folder right here. And then click on disk utility. And when that comes up, it will ask you which disk you want. So you just click on your, on your hard drive. And there's an option here for verify disk permissions. Uh, so you click that. I'm not going to click it because mine is, is clean. And when you click it, you'll start getting readouts up here in the details that show what permission is incorrectly listed. And it will go through all of them. And when it gets done, it will tell you it's finished. And then you hit the re repair disk permissions. The first process is going to take probably five to ten minutes depending on your computer speed. The next one will take probably about the same amount of time and when it's finished it will tell you uh, that it has gone through and done everything that it was supposed to do from the first list. And then when you get all done with that you just click on the verify disk and that will reset everything to the correct permissions data. So that's the trick when you get through, it should get rid of that spinning beach ball. If it doesn't, then there's another issue and you might look at your capacity of your disk or your drive and the amount of space that you have available. Because if you get down too low on available space, it can't access everything it needs to. Also, when you're working during the day, if you have a lot of applications opened, that will also slow things down. So any of them that you're not using, go back and close them or quit them. You might have to do a force quit, and that will, that will probably, probably be the better option. And there you have it. Two methods you can use to help get rid of that dreaded spinning beach ball of death. If you want a spinning beach ball, go to the beach. Otherwise, Use these methods and see if it works. I'd like to know if it's helpful, so leave a comment and let me know if it did the job. So I think that's it for today. Until I speak with you again and even after that, you stay focused.